Can't reset your AirPods? <laughs> From Apple ID locks to dirty connection points and even counterfeits, we'll guide you through all the simple solutions in just three minutes. First things first, let's make sure your AirPods have enough power to reset. Pop them in their case, plug the case into your wired or wireless charger, and let them charge for at least five minutes. Next, let's do a proper reset of your AirPods. To do that, put your AirPods in the case and close the lid. Then grab your iPhone, go to settings, then Bluetooth. Find your AirPods on the list and tap the info button. Tap forget this device and confirm. Now open the AirPods case, press and hold the setup button on the back until the light flashes white. That means your AirPods are now reset. To confirm the reset was successful, bring your AirPods close to your iPhone. A connection prompt will appear. If it says, not your AirPods, great. That means your reset worked. But if you're seeing a message that these AirPods are linked to another Apple ID, that means the previous owner should unlink them from their Apple ID first before you can reset. Here's how. The previous owner needs to open the Find My app tap devices and find your AirPods. Swipe up and tap remove this device. Enter your password and confirm removal. But if you don't have the Apple ID message, here are a few other reasons why your AirPods won't reset and how to solve it. First, outdated iOS software invites bugs that may prevent your AirPods from resetting. So let's try updating it. Go to settings, tap general, then click software update. If an update is available, Install it now. If the software update didn't fix your problem, dirt may be blocking the connection points, preventing your case from detecting and resetting your AirPods correctly. Here's a quick cleaning method. Start by wiping the AirPods exterior gently with a dry, lint-free cloth, especially around the tail, which connects to your charging case. Next, lightly dampen a cotton swab with isopropyl alcohol and use it to clear out the grime inside the charging case. And that should do the trick. Let everything dry for about five minutes before trying to reset again. Lastly, this might seem unlikely, but your AirPods might potentially be fake. One simple way to detect if your AirPods are fake is to check the serial number. Find the serial number on the box's barcode or under the AirPods case lid. Then grab your phone and visit the Apple coverage check page. Enter the serial number to confirm if the AirPods are genuine. You should see something like this. But some good counterfeits have found a way to fool this verification method. So to be sure, check out our detailed guide on spotting fake AirPods, which we have linked down below. And that's it. Your AirPods should now be reset and fully working. Got questions? Drop them in the comments below. We'll be happy to help. If you prefer reading, we have a step-by-step -step guide linked in the description, which is regularly updated with the latest solutions.